World Net Daily is reporting that a second federal judge has halted the enforcement of Obamacare mandate that religious institutions and corporations are required to pay for sterilizations, contraceptives, and abortion-inducing medications. Breitbart.com is reporting a great article about the gas shortages in New York and New Jersey, reporting mile-long lines, rationing, fights, police drawing guns. We got tweets coming in saying New Jersey is looking like a war zone, lines all the way down the highway. We have images coming in from Instagram and Twitter of people holding tanks, um, lines wrapping around the street, uh, fights breaking out of gas stations, somebody pulled out a knife. Not limited to one gas station, but gas stations all around the area. Uh, more images pouring in from just all over the region of people trying to get gas. It's rather a heartbreaking scene here. We came across this as we were uh, driving in this neighborhood trying to get a true sense of the aftermath of Sandy. As you know, the Lower East Side and the East Village without power since Sandy hit. They're not expected to get their power back since Saturday at the least, at the earliest. And look how desperate it has gotten here in this neighborhood. We're here outside the Key Foods Avenue A and East 4th Street and people are dumpster diving and what they're going after here is the food that was inside these Key Foods. We presume it all spoiled and was dumped out here for garbage. But instead, those here, some that I've spoken with, so hungry, they literally pried open this dumpster. You see that door open right now, and they are literally picking through for whatever they can take home with themselves. We have seen everybody here from the elderly to families with children literally up on top of this, looking for whatever it is that they can take home with themselves.